must have been immense. From our new detailed knowledge of the skeleton, John Hutchinson has calculated that it was more than six feet in circumference. It probably weighed 230 kilos and would have had to shift 90 liters of blood with a single beat. There's one. And it would have had to repeat that beat every five seconds. There it goes again. Weighing more than three grown men, it would have been extraordinarily powerful. And in order to pump blood around the body at high pressure, and then into the delicate lungs at a lower pressure, it's thought that our titanosaur's heart had four chambers, more like that of a bird than a reptile. So a powerful heart pumped the blood to the extremities of the body, but how did the blood get back? As in an elephant, a combination of fatty foot pads and tight skin are thought to have forced the blood from its legs all the way back to its heart. <laughs> 